Welcome one more time. Today we are presenting to you Keisha Rose Sebert biography. Keisha Rose Sebert is an American rapper, singer, and songwriter. This biography profiles her childhood, family, career, achievements, and highlights some fun facts. Keisha Rose Sebert is a prolific American rapper, singer, and a songwriter. Inheriting the music talent from her mother, Keisha rose to fame in her late teenage and caught the eyes of some big music industry players, becoming a fan favorite at the age of 20. Her biggest breakthrough came in 2009, when she collaborated with Flo Ritha for Right Round, an extremely energetic track which eventually rose to the number one spot in most charts that year. The song also got featured in the comedy movie The Hangover and Keisha became a household name. In the very next year, Keisha hit the American musical industry with two back-to-back -back hits, her debut studio album Animal and her very first extended play Cannibal. Many songs from the album climbed to top spots in several charts. Her second album Warrior was also a major success and by then, her single TikTok from her first album became the most downloaded digital song in the history of world music. Apart from topping the charts, Keisha has been actively involved in social activism and fights for LGBT and animal rights. She accused Dr. Luke of physically and mentally assaulting her and this hurt her career and she hasn't released an album since. Then, Keisha is one of the most known American musicians with almost 60 million album sales. Worldwide Childhood and Early Life of Keisha Rose Sebert Keisha was born to Patricia Rose Sebert in California, USA on March 1, 1987. Her mother was a known singer-songwriter and a respectable name in the music industry, which made it somehow easy for Keisha to make a career in music. However, when Keisha was born, the financial condition of the family wasn't good. Patricia was single mom and was taking care of Keisha and her older brother, Lagan. Keisha has openly admitted that she has no clue at all about her father. But she suspects Mick Jagger to be her real biological father. Keisha accompanied her mother to her performances while she took care of her backstage during the shows. Upon receiving a deal from a music company for her songwriting skills, Patricia moved to Nashville, Tennessee, when Keisha was four years old. She saw Keisha's interest towards the art and constantly urged her to sing songs whenever she felt sad or depressed. Keisha heeded the advice and accompanied her mother to all her recordings to learn the basics. Keisha attended Franklin High School and Brentwood High School and has admitted that she was severely bullied by her classmates for her unconventional style sense. She played musical instruments in the marching band at school and while at the college, she started taking lessons in songwriting from her mother. Keisha admits that she was a good student and secured great marks and sets, but she dropped out of college to pursue a career in music. Keisha then put all her attention and efforts into music while performing with her brother's band. Career of Keisha Rose Sebert At the age of 18, Keisha was signed on by Dr. Luke's Kimo Sabe Entertainment for her first big breakthrough. Dr. Luke was impressed by her demo recordings and said that he saw an artist with furious energy and skills to make it big in the music world. Keisha provided background vocals for Paris Hilton right around that time for her single Nothing in the World. She also contributed to Britney Spears' Lace and Leather which helped her polish her skills as a musician. These small gigs were getting her in touch with the big stars, but her own personal claim to fame came when she provided vocals for Right Round by Flo Rida, which was produced by Drive. Luke in 2008. The song was a groundbreaking success and the stage was set for Keisha to become a star musician. The song was a number one Hot 100 hit for a long time and was later featured in the hit comedy The Hangover. Keisha then signed on with RCA and in 2010, she came up with her debut album Animal which proved to be a massive hit and particularly one song from the album TikTok set all the musical charts on fire and Keisha became an instant celebrity. The song, to this day, holds the 
record to be among the most downloaded digital singles in the history. The album featured collaborations with several big artists such as Dr. Luke, Max Martin, and Benny Blanco and climbed up to the top of Billboard 200. Later in 2010, Keisha introduced her very first extended play Cannibal to her fans. It featured nine songs in total and two songs particularly titled We Are Who We Are and Blow Made There. Entry in several charts. She followed this overwhelming success with the release of I Am The Dance Commander, I Command You To Dance in 2011. In 2012, she was invited to collaborate on an album titled The Flaming Lips and Hetty Twins, where she collaborated with Bismarcky on a track titled 2012. Dr. Luke released Keisha's second studio album which was titled Warrior and influenced by rock music. It followed the success of Keisha's first album by constantly staying in the top 10 charts of most lists. Two singles Kman and Crazy Kids were met with critical and commercial acclaim, making Keisha one of the most influential musicians of this generation. Keisha then went on to a world tour with Pitbull, and the duo later came together for a single titled Timber which quickly became her third top single. Her rising career came to a shocking halt in 2014, when she accused her mentor Dr. Luke of mental, physical, and emotional abuse along with bad business practices. The entire scene threatened to destroy her career and she became inactive for quite some time. She returned to performing in April 2016, when she performed at Coachella for True Colors. The studio version of the song was released later that year. Personal Life of Keisha Rose Sebert Keisha is a hardcore environmentalist and an ordained minister. She has constantly raised her voice for homosexuals and performed their marriage ceremonies a number of times. Upon asking about her own sexuality, there has not been a straight answer from her. She has said that love has nothing to do with gender and she loves everyone equally. Keisha suffers from a severe eating disorder and has constantly gained and lost weight over the years since she has been in the limelight. She also has said that Dr. Luke is one of the reasons for her eating disorder as he body shamed her and told her to lose weight when he signed her. Keisha has been to the rehab to cure this disorder. As of May 2017, Keisha's net worth is 9 million US dollars, and as a result of constant legal battles against Dr. Luke, she has lost quite a lot of her money. How old is Keisha Rose Sebert is a most wanted question of all the Keisha Rose Sebert fans. Keisha Rose Sebert age is 30. Keisha Rose Sebert new album Rainbow. Keisha Rose Sebert best popular song is 32. Keisha Rose Sebert INSTagram ID name is Ishoas. Keisha Rose Sebert best song ever is Praying.